City of Galt is celebrating the beauty of the cow with a new public art exhibit. And Big Al is getting a preview of the fiberglass sculptures headed for 4th Street. Hey Al! Hey there, how you doing this morning? Listen, this is pretty cool. So many, uh, so many cows with the art and the, the detail. I'm looking over at Pablo Picasso, for example, over here. It's pretty cool. I love how they've made this works of art and it's really representing Oops. the city of Galt. And Mr. Borges, how did this whole thing start? How did this whole thing originate? Uh, originally, um, we were in a board meeting and we were trying to find ways to um, attract people to the city. And uh, cows are obviously something that uh, is, is uh, uh, well known here in Galt and um, we decided to uh, come up with this project and uh, that's how it all started. Yeah, so Galt has an amazing dairy culture from way back from like the 19 the 1910s uh, even further than that and this is being represented here but now you guys have can be um, linked up with different small businesses to make this happen to showcase this. Yeah, correct. Uh, we partnered with SMUD um, so all of the cows uh, were um, designed by the businesses that adopted the cow. Um, each cow has a, a hidden icon, um, and it, it really is a way to bring people to the city and learn about clean energy. Um, and so we kind of brought the two together, and uh, it's a two-year art project that will be happening here in Galt. I know. I saw the, uh, the, the cyborg cow. I'm just going to call it the cyborg cow. Yeah. I can see the, uh, the solar panel over the top. So yeah. it's talking about lots of clean energy items here. Now, who designed these things? I mean... I mean, who are the artists that made this happen? Um, so each business, to be honest, um, they they either designed it themselves or they hired an artist, mm. and that will be available on our Galt Chamber webpage. Um, it'll have the information on who designed the cow and how they came up with the idea. And now, and then, at this point, you'll just be able to get them all out there and hit the hit the road, as it were, or hit the businesses, or just put them anywhere in the city? Yeah, so um, some of the cows will be displayed in front of the business that sponsored the cow, and then a few of the others will be positioned throughout the city. Uh, you can um, stop in the Galt Chamber uh, office, and we'll have a map on um, the location of all the cows. There's a little bit of uh, a representation of all of them, but there's still some that's out set up right now, yes? Yeah, this is about half. We have another 15 um, that are still finishing up, and uh, will be out on display here in the next couple months. Nice, nice. You can check out the website and get everything. Find out your favorite one. Uh, I'm, I'm all about the cyborg because there's lots of things you can play, like lots of gears you can play with. I love interactivity. This is this is a work of art. This is this is beautiful right here. So hey, the herd on the street here in Galt. Check out the website with all the information and get involved. Back over to you guys. That is very creative. So cool. Very creative. All right. Thanks, Al.